everybody and welcome in to another episode of Train Simulator 2022. Today we are taking a look at the second pack that I have been waiting for for a little while. It is the Amtrak 50th Anniversary Heritage Paint Schemes from Chris and Jerry's Paint Shed. I will have the link for their webpage linked in the description below. And you can also check out their YouTube page. I'll have that linked in the description below as well. So... Let's get right into it. These use the True Rail Simulations P42 Enhancement Pack for the stock RSC P42 that you get with the game. Comes with one, two, three, four, five, six different schemes, and we're going to take a look at each one of them. It also comes with a new K5 LA uh, that gets installed with it as well. So we'll hop right on over to here. This is in track 46. It is just the the one that says 50 years on the side. Nothing too spiffy about it. Um, nice clean 4K textures and appears from them. And it looks pretty darn good, I must say. This is this is the dark side of it, but. Yeah, it looks look, looks pretty good. Not much to write home about it. It's, it's pretty much it is what it is. Moving right along, we've got Amtrak 100. I think believe this is the Midnight Blue scheme. And damn, does it look good! It looks good. Let's look at the top. Yeah, that looks good. I like this. It's a very good looking unit. I I don't know. Midnight Blue looks looks pretty good. I must admit. So nice weathering on the on the coupler. That's pretty good. So yeah, there's your Amtrak 100, the Midnight Blue scheme. Moving right along to Amtrak 108. This is, I believe. Phase 6. This looks like Phase 6 to me. I believe that's what this is. I like the nice red nose. It kind of reminds me of the bloody nose. It's just instead of it being on the bottom, it's on the top. I kind of like that about this. It looks really good as well. I like this as well. Get a nice look at it. Now we'll move on to my, my favorite one. And it's Amtrak 160, and it is in the Pepsi can scheme that was on the Dash 8s that Amtrak had. And God, does this look good. I'm sorry, but this by far is my favorite. I am a sucker for Pepsi can. Like, this, this is just really good. Let's, let's walk over here. Nice Amtrak 50 scheme that looks good it was really good moving right along we got Amtrak 161 in the bloody nose scheme I believe this is phase two it's either phase two or phase three I don't specifically remember. I don't know. It's the bloody nose scheme. I like it. It looks good. Nice textures as always along with the other ones. Looks good. I like it. Not a huge fan of this, but I like it. I'm not going to spend much time on it. As you can tell, I'm not spending much time on all these because it's literally just the skins. And last but not least, we've got Amtrak 50. It is the day one scheme that Amtrak had on the E8s that they have that they got, and I, this looks pretty good. This is probably my second favorite. I like I like this right here on the nose. I think it looks pretty good. So yeah, this is day one P42. Oh, the sun is just a gigantic black hole. That's cool. <laughs> it's interesting. So yeah. That is your day one scheme. And that is... 
all six of them for you. So now, like I said in the beginning, it does come with the new K5 LA from Chris and Jerry as well. So I have the driver enabled on the Pepsi Cannon. So we'll go ahead and and uh, listen to the horn. Nothing really else changed. It's still your base uh, True Rail P42 that you get with the enhancement pack. It's just literally the horn upgrade and and the paint schemes. Everything else is the same. You can still still do do the marker lights. Do the marker like still can turn the number boards on and off. Still quill the horn, so all that good stuff. So yeah, let's go ahead and I'll show the horn get off to you guys. I must say that K5 does sound pretty darn good compared to to what we got. Not saying that the, the K5 that came with the enhancement pack from Truro was not good. It was good, but I like this better. It just I don't know what it is. It sounds more P42 eating me. I don't know what it is, but it sounds more like a, a horn like the K5 you would hear on P42. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I don't know. You tell me in the comments below what you guys think. I like it. I think it sounds pretty damn good, especially with the coil. Yeah, that sounds pretty badass. Alright. So that is that. That is going to do it for the talking portion of the episode. Uh, I'm going to do run-bys with all six on the Miami to West Palm Beach route. Um, we'll have a run-by of all six leading, and then that will end the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you leave your comments in this comment section below. Make sure you hit the like button and the subscribe button. Got a lot of new things that are going to be coming out for 2022 that I'm working on behind the scenes. So, be expecting some updates on that here in the near future in an American Truck Sim video. And I will see catch you guys on the next episode. Take care.